Hello Boozers and welcome to the next installment of Booze Reviews. Tonight, today, well today since I'm wearing sunglasses was tonight, I'd be wearing my sunglasses at night. I'll let you guys think about that for a second as my dad jokes on this Father's Day weekend are horrible. That's right, it is Father's Day weekend and today I've got something that Nick sent out to me. Um, it is a Imperial Stout. It's a limited edition backdraft series from Pump House Brewing, if I remember correctly. And yep, yeah, Pump House Brewery in Moncton, New Brunswick. And there is a long story. The Pump House proudly introduced the latest offering in our limited edition backdraft series, Kazakh Imperial Stout. The tradition of a great Russian Imperial Stout, Kazakh is in celebration of our co-founder Lily. Lilia Fraser's Russian and Kazakhstani heritage. Our first batch of Imperial Stout was brewed in the fall of 2004 and was part of the selection of beers that led the Pump House to be awarded Canadian Brewery of the Year in 2005. With six different types of malts, Kazakh, Kazakh Imperial Stout is dark as night and abundant in flavor with a beautiful balance of clean bitterness from the subtle citrus notes of the Magnum and Cecilia, or Cecilia hops. Made only with water, barley, hops, yeast, and no zrotrev. Okay, and then it goes into French. Like most of our things do. So the label is pretty awesome. I was trying to figure that out. And uh, yeah, that's uh, it, the colors is like Kazakhstani, which is kind of cool. All right. And what did I say it was at 8.7%? Ooh, it's excited to get out. All right, again, thank you, Nick, for this. This is awesome. And, whew, as you see, it is black, as they say. There is a three fingers worth of head there, so there's a lot of head going on there. Um, quite a nice looking body, and the head is retaining quite nicely. Got a nice smell from there, from the roasted malts. Let's find out exactly what else we have. Now just a nice roasted hop smell. Mm, I do like that, do like that a lot. Well folks, cheers. Mm. That was actually a really beautiful Russian Imperial stout, or yeah, Russian Imperial. Wow. Mm. You have that. You do have sort of like a small citrus note on there. You do have the roasted malts in there leading to a nice balance. And it's sort of like a small coffee, but with a a bitter roasted note on the back of the throat there that stays with you. The 8.7 is a not there. So we're looking at a very dangerous beer here. Mm. There's a subtle sweetness in there, which is really interesting, but really nice. I do, do really do like that. Wow. It's got a beautiful flavor to it quite impressed. So folks, have you had this one before? Do you like it? Do you not like it? What are your thoughts on this beer? For me, Pump House, that is a really good beer. I've had one of their beers before and I think it was their Blueberry Ale, but I've never seen this one out here. So it's nice and refreshing to see that this is here. Um, wow. Yeah, really, really quite nice. Well, I got this beer. I wasn't too sure which brewery that was because it had it in, <laughs> not in English, but that's Pump House. It's kind of cool. 
Well, folks, until next time, I am PK saying cheers. Stay frosty. We'll see you real soon. Thanks again for joining. And sorry about the uh, camera balancing a little bit. It seems that my table isn't as stable as I thought it was. Till next time, have a great day. And please be safe out there. Please be safe out there. Cheers. <laughs>